Honey is one of the healthiest foods in the world. Honey has been used for centuries, mostly due to its antibiotic properties. Many people around the world use honey every day, to improve their health, and to treat and prevent many different health problems. You can use honey topically and internally. So, when applied topically, honey can kill a wide range of pathogens such as MRSA and flesh-eating bacteria. It was also found that the treated bacteria did not build up any resistance like conventional antibiotics. The experts say that its effectiveness lies in its ability to fight infection on multiple levels, making it hard for bacteria to develop resistance. We have some good news for you, a group of scientists have discovered that this type of honey is killing every type of bacteria, even the superbugs. Just take a look at the video below and find out more about this. The results from this study were published in the European Journal of Clinical Microbiology and Infectious Diseases. This is very important for all of us, especially now, when many bacteria and superbugs are becoming resistant to the prescription drugs and antibiotics. The name of this honey? We are talking about the super healthy Manuka honey, also known as jelly bush honey, which is produced in New Zealand. You'll be amazed when we tell you that this super healthy honey has become so popular in the past few years that shortages have been reported and fake products have been sold. Leading New Zealand Manuka producers to seek trademark protection, similar to French Champagne or Scottish whisky for example. It's easy to see why now that the secret is out about this honey's incredible health benefits. Manuka honey kills MRSA and other superbugs. According to the experts, this type of honey is made by bees foraging on the nectar of Leptospermum scoparium. The New Zealand Manuka bush, as well as tea trees native only to Australia and New Zealand. In this study, the experts revealed that the honey killed every bacteria or pathogen it was tested on. And, as we mentioned before, the honey can be applied topically to help fight against infections of the skin, cuts and insect bites, or taken internally. This is very important for you to remember, the most exciting difference with the Manuka honey that was tested is that none of superbugs killed by the honey were able to build up immunity, a common problem with today's antibiotics. New antibiotics tend to have short shelf lives, as the bacteria they attack quickly become resistant. Many large pharmaceutical companies have abandoned antibiotic production because of the difficulty of recovering costs. Developing effective alternatives could therefore save many lives. She also mentioned that the Manuka honey contains a compound called methaglyoxal. That combines with other unknown compounds to cause multi-system failure that destroys the bacteria. Where to find Manuka honey? Just like regular honey, this type of honey is now sold in health food stores and online, although the supply levels have fluctuated in recent years and fake honey scams have been documented. So, remember this, when looking for Manuka honey it is best to look for one that is UMF certified. UMF certified? Here's what you need to know, the term UMF stands for Unique Manuka Factor, which is the phytochemical property derived from the Manuka bushes that gives it its unique properties. This term is regulated by the Unique Manuka Factor Honey Association of New Zealand and a handful of certified Manuka products can be found on Amazon.com. The brand Comavita Manuka Honey is available on Amazon and is UMF certified. We all know that further research needs to be done. But, it's safe to say that Manuka Honey shows great results in defeating. One of the biggest health challenges faced by humanity in the 21st century, and this research should not be taken lightly.